what is up y'all welcome back to teeks week probably teeks week 13 i'm assuming <laughs> i never know but happy new year this is my first official vlog of the new year because if you guys been watching my previous teeks weeks then you guys probably have been watching teeks weeks that were in like november and december of 2020 so those were all like pre-recorded videos so this is the official first teeks week of the new year so happy new year since i haven't said it already um yeah today is thursday january the 14th which is the night before um zahara's first road trip um unfortunately her first road trip is for um not a very good thing my aunt actually passed away my grandpa's sister so me my mom and my grandpa and zahara are all riding down to tampa florida to go to my aunt's funeral so it's so horrible that we have to start off um 2021 like this already with my one of my favorite aunts passing um my great aunt so yeah um but yeah so that is what's happening so um we've been staying at my mom's house um if you guys didn't know we've been staying here for the past uh like basically since she's been born um just because my mom has been helping me out a lot with the baby and stuff like that um and it's just really been helpful my mom's been helping me like get into the groove of motherhood and things like that so it's just been really helpful having my my mom around um so yeah right now i'm just packing up all of her stuff um y'all will see once i go in the room like because we've been literally living she's in the she's actually in my mom's room right now taking a bath because we're giving her a bath before we leave um we're leaving at about like 6 a.m in the morning it's gonna take us two hours to get to my grandparents house and then it'll take us about three hours to get to tampa florida so yeah so yeah i haven't really been able to like update y'all on like motherhood and everything but we washed this okay first of all this room is a disaster literally but that's because i've been packing um we did wash her clothes i have a cheese it box in the middle of her thing because i was i was eating while i was packing but yeah i am just trying to decide on um what i'm going to take for her um so these are all washed and then that's just like blankets and stuff and then my camera bag and stuff i have both of her diaper bags of course y'all seen the other diaper bag but this diaper bag was actually gifted um, from her uncle and her auntie for Christmas. Um, and it's a pretty good size. So I think I'm going to put like extra clothes in her bottles in here. Um, because I do want to try to pump a little bit tonight to have like milk to take bottles. Or when I pump and take bottles. Um, so yeah. And then I have my breast pump down here because... I was pumping milk. Um, so yeah, I have a lot of stuff that I have to get together, y'all. Like, we literally have been living out of this room. It's crazy. But yeah, so that's just a little bit of, of an update. But um, yeah, I'm not going to bore y'all too much with um, the us packing and stuff like that. Um, because I do want to show y'all basically i guess this is kind of going to be like a teeks weekend so y'all probably see this the following week probably next weekend which will be like january after their inauguration january the 22nd no january the 23rd y'all probably be watching that that saturday so the following week um because i need to catch up with my teeks weeks and get back into the swing of things so i can kind of like show y'all like what i've like how i've been managing motherhood and things like that oh i did just purchase um this really helpful item right here um let me show y'all it is called the beluga baby it's basically like a baby wrap and um y'all this thing is so freaking helpful i just got it in the mail the other day and it just really i'm gonna post like a little picture of it right here so y'all can see 
um, me wearing her in it but it just like helps me like calm her down um because she just wants to be held a lot and now that she's two months she's officially two months um when she turned to what's tuesday of this week so now that she's older like she's like still being like really attached to me when she was like a little bit younger she wasn't i mean she was attached to me but my mom was still able to like help me with her and stuff but now like that she's like get growing she just really wants to still just be by me all the time so let me show y'all what this looks like um this is not sponsored i actually bought this myself um she's crying because she is fussy but i'm gonna leave the link to it in the description box below love this brand love this company it's the beluga baby wrap carrier baby wrap carrier and it's by a small owned business a woman owned business as well and she is based in canada so i really really like this so thank you Haley, for creating this thing because it's literally a game changer and a lifesaver so i can literally carry her around and have my hands free um and like get things done um without her like being fussy and like me having to like carry her around because she just wants me to like walk around the house with her and things like that so let's go let's actually go see what fussy is fussy and fussing about what is fussy fussing about what are you fussing about fussy <laughs> you took a bath she liked the vlog mommy be back right she want to be on camera she's a natural so yeah y'all i'm gonna finish um packing up her stuff getting everything ready um like i said i got her bottles i was sterilizing her bottles i have a bottle sterilizer and warmer i'm actually bringing it with me to take in the hotel but i just sterilized all her bottles and stuff like that y'all already know these are the only bottles that zahara will take um is the como tomo bottles these are the only ones that she likes so yeah these will be the only ones that i'm taking i have a bunch of them um i actually have two more um small ounce ones i actually gotta find them on that. i think one of them is in her diaper bag and the other one she used today so these should be enough and then um i'm taking my spectra pump uh bottles as well so yeah so i'm gonna finish up doing what i need to do and then i guess i'll update y'all when we leave and take y'all along on baby's first road trip you ready to go on a road trip zahara not yet baby i mean the cars you can't go on the road trip yet <laughs> it's not time yet uh. It's not time yet. Cover me face, mommy. It's not a time yet, baby. Well, it's blurry anyway, so they don't need to see your face. It's not time to go on a road trip yet. Mommy, I'm ready to go. I'm re Why is she so quiet? You ready to go? <laughs> I'm ready to be a YouTuber. <laughs> okay. Say we see you guys in the morning. Okay, I'll put her head on. Say we see you guys in the morning. She already in the car seat, ready to go. She love freaking car rides, y'all. Oh, she freaking loves car rides. Say yeah. I love the car rides. I love the car rides, mommy. I love the car rides. Yeah. Say <laughs> good morning, everybody. Good morning, everybody. It is what time? We behind schedule. I don't even know where my phone is. Where? Are you? You send your phone in the bathroom. Oh, say so it's around seven, and we going on our first road trip. Yay! Yay. Wow. Look how she looking. Very early. Yeah, it's early, so we about to get ready to go because we already running late. You sanitize the car? Yes. Everything is sanitized and ready to go. Look how she looking. Can you wipe it down with the Clorox? Huh? 
All right, so y'all, we about to get ready to head out. That, you got all your stuff on? No, let me just double check one more round. Okay, you can um, set that. Here, I'll take it. All right, you said you didn't got it. Let me just check my room one more time. Oh, you'll be out. Say, yay, we can wait on that trip. Yeah, we going on that trip. Say, yeah, we going on a trip. Yeah, Mama. I'm so ready. I'm so ready. It's not for a good cause, but I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. Say, I'm ready to go, Granny. I mean, I'm ready to go, Mommy. I'm ready to go. All right, y'all. So, I tried to flat on my hair, do my hair as best as I could. I just put on this headband. Um, I'm going to look real dressed now. Um, yeah. I threw this headband on. Probably going to put my hair in a ponytail. I was trying to do like a sleep back look, but it's messing up. So, but yeah, hair in a pony. Um, I'm going to put my hair in a pony. Hair in a bandana. I really want to put my hair up because it, I didn't get a chance to wash it. So it's kind of. Not doing what I needed to do, so probably be in buns and ponies all weekend. Um, I got on a hoodie, black hoodie, with my blankie, my favorite blankie outfit, leggings, and some Uggs. Well, we way behind schedule. It's 7-12. We were supposed to leave at 6. That is because Little Zahara had to eat and everything before we left. So, yeah. Say, so I got my outfit on that I had on when I was in, when I came home from the hospital. Yeah. So, I'm going to put her this hat on. Um, She had this bib on because she was eating. My mom was trying to feed her while I was trying to finish getting dressed. But, yeah. Yeah, baby. And these have little mittens on them, which I really like. So, are you hiding your face? So yeah, we're gonna put your hat on and we're gonna get ready to go. Alright, I put some earrings on, but it's still not giving me no doing me no justice. I need to I feel like I need to put my hair in a ponytail because I am just not feeling it. I'm not feeling it. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's the headband. I'm just not feeling it. But um this is about to be the first like a road trip that I take without like my grandma is about to feel so weird like taking a trip without my grandma because this is usually something that we always do with my grandma and it's usually like three generations um with my niece and stuff so this is about to be really weird but i guess you know we're going with her papa so her grand great grandpa so um yeah this will be a trip her first trip that she'll be able to take with him so even though it's for it's for my auntie passing so it's not really like an exciting um as an exciting road trip but um it is giving her the opportunity to get out the house um and yeah with us still making sure that we stay safe as well and everything um because she has been cooped up in the house so a little road trip should be fun <laughs> a little road trip getting up the house to see things should be nice, huh? Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> You're so funny, Zahara. <laughs> that headband was making my hair look super flat. I mean, my hair is flat right now because it's like needs to be washed and it has a lot of oil in it, which my hair. There's not really like way too much oil because oil weighs my hair down, but yeah, I think I like this better. I'll put the headband on when I like go to sleep, but I need some type of style. I felt, I don't know. I don't know what I felt like, but yeah. I'm gonna get ready to head out of here. I see I got a new lens. Yeah, my hair definitely is really greasy, as you would say. Really oily, which I do not like at freaking all. 
I hear my hair is like extremely oily. We took a pit stop at my granny's. Look at this one. She is acting a little jealous. Are you acting a little jealous? Are you acting a little jealous? Huh? You jealous as Zara. You was my first baby. You were my first baby. So we have my grandma's house right now. This is my cover to my camera, but her little bag is over or her. Where? Oh, my mom took her bag. Her car seat right there. Just changed her diaper. And my grandpa and Emma are out here packing the car. Yeah. You had to take a pit stop. It's raining bad out there. So yeah, that's my granddaddy. <laughs> granddaddy ready for the road trip. <laughs> what you doing, girl? Yeah, hmm. we gotta put Zahara in their car seat. Who bear is that? Who brought that bear here? That's cute. Oh, Lady. That's scary. I'm weak. you doing up in here? I'm weak. Wiping down everything in the room. This is our room. Nice it's a suite. Um, so yeah, 
Yeah, my granddad in the bathroom. This is our TV. Two beds. Ooh, it's a mirror right here. I see how short I am. And then it's a sink right there. My granddad coming out the bathroom. And it's a closet right here. Did you wipe this stuff down, Ma? Over here. And then I'm gonna swipe and down everything. Of course, the closet, because we don't want to catch that Rona. And then this is like the pool. I don't know if I can see it. Oh. I don't know how you let this thing up. See, it's a pool down there. Yeah. You wipe off these remotes. Right, yeah. Did you spray the beds? Because that's important. You ain't do the bathroom yet, did you? I did. Oh, okay. So, yeah. My mom is not playing. She's not playing. So, yeah. I'm sleeping with this Right. So, yeah, I'm about to get her situated. Alright, so as y'all can see, little Zahara is waking up from her nap. How was your trip, baby? Did you like your first road trip? Huh? Yeah, so she just ate um, not too long ago um, when we were in the car, but I'm about to like fully feed her again. Um, she's still asleep right now, as y'all can see. She's still asleep right now, so I think I'm going to take time while she sleeps to pump a bottle. Um, try to pump two full bottles, so I'll have one to take. Um, today is the family hour. Um, I think I told y'all that. So we have to be to the family hour at 5. Um, I don't know what time it is right now. But yeah, the family hour is at 5. And I'm thinking about going because it's not going to be really anybody in in there. Um, in the like little family hour part. Because they're going to be rotating everybody out to see um, my aunt. So I'm going to go to the family hour. Um, I'm not going to the funeral tomorrow with my... I don't think my mom is going to the funeral either. Just my grandpa because that's of course my grandpa's sister but um i think i'm going to go um to the family hour and i'm just going to take her i don't have a stroller yet because i just didn't buy one because i'm not going any i haven't been going anywhere i'm not i wasn't planning on going anywhere and um yeah like i just haven't bought it yet i know which one that i want to get um but i was going to wait to get it um, and then I was gonna buy it before we were going on this trip and my mom was like, uh, yeah, don't worry about it. She was like, cause y'all probably just stay in the room. So yeah, but now we ended up coming, so I don't have my stroller, but, um, I did buy a carrier. So I think I'm just going to put her in the carrier and take her that way. And then we gonna be, it's gonna be in and out real quick. Like, so it's not even any use of taking the stroller because she's probably going to be fussy and not sit in the stroller um, because she literally likes being like this with me, like 24-7, like up against me um, because I'm breastfeeding. Um, she's used to like my scent and stuff like that. So yeah, even now when I try to leave her like with my mom, like um, not even leave her with my mom, like but, but if I like walk into the other room and like my mom has her, she starts crying. So like my mom was like, yeah, like I was talking to everybody at work and it was like, she's going to be like that for a while because you're breastfeeding and like she's just going to want you all the time. Um, and like even like when we stopped at a rest area area and my mom and my grandpa stayed in the car and I just went out to use the bathroom, she started crying. And as soon as I got back in the car, she just got back calm so yeah let me know if you're a mom and you breastfeed and you experience that or just like with your kids like that attachment um with your newborn like crying like um and give me like some tips because i don't know like i feel like she's gonna be like this for a while because i'm breastfeeding or just in general i mean she's been in my stomach for nine months like she's used to me she's used to my scent hey baby She's used to my scent and everything like that. So, yeah, she's been attached to me for nine months. So, I kind of get it. I understand why she would be, like, really wanting me all the time. Um, and she's with me all day. Like, she's literally with me all day. I always have her. So, yeah. But, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and start getting dressed. Um, hopefully, we go get food because I'm hungry. Like I said, I'm about to, well, first I'm going to pump and then I'm going to start getting dressed. 
And yeah, um, chill out for a second. Get her together, probably change her clothes and everything. And I need to change her diaper, actually. So, yeah, I guess I will update y'all in a few. She's being fussy, y'all see. Okay, I'll update y'all in a few. Hers, yes. Got on her little bug outfit. Hey, we had to put this hat on because I didn't have any other hat that met. Okay. And the outfit. Yeah, you look cute. You got, you got outfits in that bag, right? Yep, it's plenty of outfits in there. And um, diaper coffee? Yep. Okay. So this is what I look like, y'all. I did not know Tampa was so nice. I was so young when I came here. It's huge. This is where my granddaddy from. You know they got cruise ships go out of here. Do they? Mm-hmm. Yeah. When they when the cruises are running, yeah, it's a port. Yes. Oh, Tampa Port. I didn't even know that. Oh, we used to come here all the time and I was so young, I don't remember. They go a Burger King, but we ain't eating that. There go your bucks, granddad, Tampa Buccaneers. Where are we at? <laughs> okay, you just going straight and then you it's four minutes away. We're going to KFC. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Well, you know how to get back there and how to get back there. Yeah. yeah, we got the GPS. Okay. Just to stay here right here? Oh, shoot. Just to stay here. Okay. Is it that? No, that ain't the stadium. Is it? Oh, yeah, it is. Wait. I can't tell. It's something. There's a college. So maybe they got a bunch of tents. Wait a minute. What we at? <laughs> This your city. We, yeah. You should know. <laughs> That's some stadium. That might be the books where the books play. Is it? No. Okay. That's a big stadium. It's a stadium. It say go books. Yeah, they might do anything. I don't know. I don't know. They might do it. Change it everything. Good. No. Unless right, Grandy. College stadium. Oh, maybe yeah. It could be the college stadium. It's, college it's stadium. huge. Whatever it is. No, that That's is. That's, That's it. There it go. Yeah. Wow. That's crazy. Now my granddad from here talking about he don't know what's going on. He ain't been here so long. Well, you have been here. You just he come, he don't come down here. Yeah, down here, yeah. Okay. If you're from Tampa, drop it in the comments below. Say go Bucks. You know the Super Bowl is here. Yeah, I know. Yeah, oh, the, is it? In February. In February. Oh, in February, the reason, okay. Next month. It don't be here every year, do it? No, you ain't taking somewhere every year. Oh, this city about to be jumping. Jumping. I wonder how they gonna do that with COVID. <coughs> hey, mamas. You got on your Bucks colors, the red and the black, huh? You got on the red and the black? Yeah, they might, yeah. I don't know if they can, they might not let them. You know they be doing the virtual stuff too. I don't know how, it, um, where they people buy tickets virtually and be in the stands. Oh, it's saying make a U-turn. Why? Wow. It must be on the other side. I wasn't paying attention because I was talking to y'all. Back at the room. We in Boston Market. I got chicken, mashed potatoes, macaroni and cheese, and cornbread. Ma, when the last time you had Boston Market? It's been a minute. <laughs> she over there smashing. <laughs> We're just enjoying our food. It's been a long day. But baby did a good job on her first road, her first day of her road trip. She looking at you, Grandad. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It is the next day. Today is Saturday. Is it January the 16th? January don't went so fast. It's crazy. But I'm gonna call my mom and Sahara is back there. Um, we on our way to go get breakfast before my mom and my grandpa have to go to my aunt's uh, funeral. So 
me and the baby are gonna stay in the room. They're going to the funeral, so I'm gonna go get me some food first. Um, well, all of us food. Cause we only had this little lunch baggy stuff that my mom got from downstairs. Grab, grab and go bags and go. from the hotel cause they're not doing regular breakfast food because of COVID. So yeah, they didn't really have nothing in there. So. Um, I guess I can order mm -hmm. the curbside pickup. We gotta sit here and figure out what right. we yeah. wanna eat. So that's pretty much what we're doing. I was just gonna order IHOP curbside pickup. That's where we're at now. And then we just, but we probably gonna go to, we still gonna go to Starbucks? We can. Cause we just wanna see around Tampa. My mom said she ain't. I haven't been here. I mean, just run around as a dog. Yeah. So that's what we doing. She picked up for it. You gotta go on the app and see what you want, and then I'll just mm -hmm. order everything. They got chicken and pancakes? They tried it. Three yeah, <laughs> waffles, but okay. Yeah. So, yeah, that's pretty much it, y'all. I just got a butt in my head. Kind of white t shirt, and I finally have on some jeans. I haven't put on jeans in so long. Um, and my Uggs. That's it, bought me for Christmas, so. That's pretty much it. It's nice out here. Say, mommy in the Starbucks line? You getting the Starbucks? She do not like this pacifier, y'all. What is up, y'all? So me and Z are in the room. Hi, baby. Hi. Yeah. 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 So yeah, me and Z are in the room. <laughs> she loves the camera um her grandma and my grandpa her great grandpa um went to the funeral as i told y'all the funeral was at two it's about five o'clock now um i told y'all we weren't going due to covid and stuff like that but um yeah we've been chilling out in the room yeah you like that camera <laughs> we've been chilling out in the room um i've been just editing teeks week um let me set it up I've been editing our, she just spit up on me. Let me set this down. You just spit up. You spit up. You spit her up. Yeah. You just spit up. Cause you just got done eating. You get so happy when you spit up too. Does it feel better when you do that? So, anywho, um, let me see. Girl, I'm trying to adjust. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> so, anywho, yeah, they went to the funeral. Um, I like I said, we didn't go. I just been here editing Teeks Week um, number twelve for you guys, or thirteen, one of them, probably twelve. Um, I've just been editing it. Um, I put up my birth vlog already. And y'all, that video has been literally getting so many views, which is crazy. I did not expect that because, as y'all know, like the viewership on my channel has been down for quite some time. So, shout out to y'all for like showing out on that video. Um, and just like, I don't know, I guess you guys just enjoyed it. Um, it really was like real and raw so i don't know i'm just extremely excited i'm an extremely like excited to see where my channel goes like am um, i always still um i was kind of happy to see that you know the video garnished a lot of views um because i'm like i was starting to get kind of discouraged about my channel um so it, was, it felt good to be like okay just keep going when you keep posting you keep posting you you really don't know like what type of results you will see on youtube so it's always good to just keep posting i'm excited i'm like the new year is starting off pretty amazing look at her it was already amazing because of you though but yeah <laughs> y'all i'm telling you she's a natural like she really loves the camera like she's looking at the camera like every time i turn on the camera she's like what is this but yeah, so I'm super excited about that. So that's what I've been doing. I've been editing since we've been on the road, trying to get that video up. Yeah, and then I was gonna film a lookbook. Yeah, yeah, mommy was gonna film a, you a lookbook. Hold on, let me stand. Yeah, I was going to film a lookbook video for her, um, but I think I'm gonna do it when I get home because 
Um, I brought a lot of cute little outfits, but I want to... There's some other outfits that I want to include in the lookbook. Um, and then, by the time I went to go, like, try to film the lookbook, she was asleep. And then I was editing. I was watching the funeral online, of course, since I didn't go. And then um, it just started getting dark. So I was like... And then once I started going through the outfits that I wanted to film, I realized, like, there were some pieces that I wanted to put with some of the outfits that I didn't bring um, so I was like, you know what, I'll just film, we'll film the lookbook when we get home. So yeah, I want to get that up as well. Um, a little baby try on haul lookbook, but I love this little outfit she has on. Her auntie Mallory bought her this and it feels so cute, but as you can tell, it's getting a little tight. So she about to be out of this outfit. <laughs> she about to be out of this soon. So yeah, but yeah, that's what we're doing y'all. We've been chilling out. I think I'm going to get ready to pump. I got stuff sitting out on the bed in the background because, like I said, I was going through her stuff. Um, but I'm going to get ready to pump um, because I don't want to pump while my grandpa is here. Um, well, I, I did pump while he was here, but I was like on the other side. But I'm going to take this opportunity, opportunity to pump while he's not here. We are literally like in our little chill clothes. Yeah, you, like, you see the camera? Yeah, we vlogging. And that's pretty much it. We go home tomorrow. Um, my mom was like, oh my goodness, there's a casino right down the road and we can't even go because we got the baby. <laughs> it's so crazy, like, being a new mom. Like, I have a baby now, so it's, like, a lot of stuff that I, like, can't do. I don't have, like, the freedom to just get up and go. Like, oh, well, I do, but, like, I'm not going to leave her with my grandpa. Like, she's still young, so she needs her mommy. So, yeah. So yeah, y'all, that's pretty much it. We're not doing much. This little one is having some fun, aren't you? You're having some fun, mommy. I'm having some fun. Oh, by the way, I've been drinking a bunch of body armor drinks. Um, this tropical punch one was good, but I really love the fruit punch ones. So I've been drinking a bunch of these to because they say that it boosts your milk supply for breastfeeding. So I've been drinking this and I did um, have a coffee today from Starbucks. I told y'all that. Um, we ate our I we actually ate our IHOP earlier as well too. I didn't get to show y'all that. Um, so yeah. Um, and then I thought I was gonna get a little bit hungry. Um, so I did buy some. These are my faves. I love these. These little flavor twist honey barbecue chips. Um, I bought some little animal cookies as well from the dollar store. And then my mom's hot Cheetos because she loves hot Cheetos. And then I bought this little deep dish pizza just in case they didn't come back in time. And I got a little bit hungry. Um, but I haven't made it yet. But I think I might make it because I'm actually getting hungry. But this is the fruit punch body armor. So, yeah. That's in there as well. There's a hard little bottle is sitting over here. <laughs> um, so yeah. Um, but yeah, y'all, I forgot to tell y'all why when I went into Dollar Tree the other day, I mean earlier today, Dollar General today, it was these two girls arguing. It was this um the it was a girl that was shopping in the Dollar General, and then the cashier was um like a little she was like a younger little girl and she was like first when i was walking in the dollar general um i heard the girl that was shopping come out and she was like i'll slap her on my life blah, blah, blah. I call, i'll call my people up here and we'll get we can get down we can get down and i'm like what's going on so it was two older um people outside and they was just looking i'm looking at her and i just walked in and then as i'm looking for tylenol because i needed some tylenol because i was having a little bit of tooth pain I hear one of the girls working there finally as I'm finally about to go up to the register I was about to ask her where the Tylenol is at and she was like because she came in here with her coupons and that's on my mama that's on my mama and I'm like girl I'm like that is so unprofessional of you for you to be you to be working here and you're literally arguing with a customer like over coupons or whatever like i could see the girl outside okay she's the customer so whatever she could say whatever she wants to but the fact that this girl was in the dollar general and she was just like ragging off at the mouth about 
this customer i'm like because they looked like they were about the same age but i'm like still like that is so unprofessional so i was trying to help the girl out that worked there by like distracting her and i was like hey like where can i find a tylenol because i'm like girl like that's not a good look like you were in the store and there's other customers in here and there was like another um older man and like um a middle-aged man like in the aisle with me down the medicine aisle and like they were just looking at her and i'm literally like sitting there trying to help her out like i'm like girl I shouldn't have been trying to help her out like and I wouldn't be surprised if she ended up losing her job if the other girl comes up there and complains um, because she was really turning it up I'm like that is it's just unprofessional you just don't do stuff like that like if you work somewhere like I understand somebody might try you but just don't do that in front of customers and she just kept saying she was like I ain't gonna let nobody get my energy off I ain't gonna let nobody get my energy off but she was just being loud and obnoxious and I'm like sis you're the cashier realize that like realize you're at a place of business like you need to be a little bit more professional regardless if it's the dollar general or not so that's just a tip like i know somebody people people feel like they could just pop off all the time like but you gotta realize like you're ruining you're ruining other people's businesses when you do that so i mean i ain't gonna let nobody try me either but i'm real about being professional ain't that right baby yep yep <laughs> yes ma'am so yeah i need to put a cover um over this little pillowcase because i really don't like her being on the pillow hotel pillowcases um so yeah i'm gonna put the little oh so i'm gonna put the little cover over that um that's what i did last night i let her sleep on top of like a one of her blankets on the pillows because no, we just don't trust these hotels, okay? Trust these little hotel pillow cases. Yeah, you like the vlog? <laughs> yeah. All right, y'all, so we not really doing much. Like I said, I'm really just chilling out. But, um, yeah, if anything changes, I will update y'all um, later. Like I said, this was hopefully... Y'all are enjoying this vlog, and y'all share it, and like it, and comment, and all of the above. So, yeah. We will talk to y'all a little later. <laughs> They start uh they start teething early now. Now we just said we forgot to get the teaser pills. I don't have to get them online. You know, I know we was in get from, He got um, some. I had bought him a, a whole thing and the rascal stopped taking them. When mm -hmm. I bought them, he stopped taking them. Um, you know, mama used to always get them from Tampa. I know. And she we used was, to and she used to go out and get me the teething powder for my kids. And we was going to buy the store and forgot. Look at this baby. Lord have mercy. Yeah. <laughs> who did you who was that messing with that baby? <laughs> Who was that messing with that baby? Girl, if your Gigi was living, you Ooh. would be, <laughs> you would be rotten. <laughs> right. <Yeah>. Look at that. <laughs> you would be rotten. <laughs> yes, you would. But yes. she cried Gigi. She cried You must know when I say Gigi. I know. Gigi. I know. Your Gigi. Yep. Yeah.
You can be right. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. You did it, baby. That yeah, baby's smiling. What's up, y'all? Let me pause this real quick. Um, welcome back. It is, I believe, two days since our road trip that we took. It's Wednesday, January the 20th. Today is actually the day of the um, inauguration. Um, I'm currently watching that right now. Zahara just actually woke up not too long ago. Um, please do not mind my mommy hair. This is literally, I watched it last night and I didn't get to do anything to it yet. Y'all know I don't care. I'll be making my vlogs raw and real. Want to say hi to the camera? You got bed head. You have the bed head. Yeah. You have the bed head? You have the bed head? So Jennifer Lopez just got done um, performing at the inauguration. Um, ooh, girl, you got bad head for real. Mommy was making her some oatmeal. I was boiling the um, tea kettle so I can make me some oatmeal. I really love Quaker's oatmeal. Um, I usually do the strawberry and banana. You looking at the camera? Yeah. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing right now. I'm just chilling out. I just wanted to update y'all. Um, Monday we did um, kind of just chill out. We took the rental car back. And that was pretty much it with that. Um, so yeah. Yeah. She's boo-booing. I believe she is creating a poop explosion diaper for me. Please um, raise your right hand. Oh, they're swearing him me. in. I, Joseph Biden. Robinette Biden Jr., do solemnly swear. I, Joseph Robinette Biden Jr., do solemnly swear. That I will faithfully execute. That I will faithfully execute. She's the office lounger. of President of the United States. The office of President of the United States. She's a lounger, a puppy. Have a puppy. To the best of my ability. Preserve, protect, and defend. Preserve, protect, and defend. The Constitution of the United States. I don't know why all this feels so staged and fake so to me. So That's just me. I'm still watching it. Even though it all just seems fake and staged. Y'all know how I feel about the government and the election and all of that stuff. But yeah, that's tea for another day. Um, but yeah. Dang, you got sworn in fast. But anyways, so yeah, I'm about to just chill out with her. About to probably change her diaper. I'm going to eat my oatmeal. Um, and I don't know, I'll probably plan out some video content. I already have like video content planned out. But um, I'm just trying to figure out how I want to, what I want to do. Like as far as like with like regular content for my channel. Because of course I got the Teaks Weeks vlogs um, and everything like that. So yeah, and I definitely need to do something to my hair. It's so funny though, y'all, because Zahara loves my bun. This is like a sloppy, really like not even done bun. But she loves when I have my hair curly and it's like up in a top knot. Child, I finally know why I wore so many top knots. It's because my daughter loves them. <laughs> my daughter was going to love them. Um, so yeah, but she loves the buns. Isn't that right, mamas? You love mommy's buns? Yeah, you love mommy's buns. Oh my goodness, you smiling? Oh my goodness, you love mommy's buns. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. Mwah. Mwah. Mommy gonna change your diaper? Mommy gonna change your diaper? You ready to change your diaper? I know it's probably a little poop explosion in there. Yeah. I let her have her um, feet out. I unbuttoned her little thing. I let her have her feet out because sometimes she gets, you know, she likes having her feet out. So, and she likes looking at this camera too. <laughs> oh, look how she's looking at it, y'all. It's so funny. She's a natural. Uh, you know, mommy loves these feet. Mommy loves these feet. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to get my day started, you guys, and I'll maybe update y'all a little later.